Well, hey everybody, as you can plainly see, I'm not over at the homestead working today. I'm at my oldest boy's place at Gripland. Uh, he has been calling and asking me to help him with some weed spraying. Uh, my 45-gallon uh, John Deere sprayer just works so much better for a big application like this. So guys, come on and check out what I got going on today. Well, hey guys, Jeff here. Welcome back to the channel and thanks for tuning in. I am over today at my oldest boy's place at his farm and he has called and asked me to help him get caught up on some uh, weed spraying. He's got a bunch of areas that need to be caught up and I'm very blessed. I have the uh, John Deere sprayer that goes over in the back of my gator. It has the big boom on the back of it that swings out and will spray a 12 foot path every time you go through. So uh, anyway, I'm over here today getting ready to unload and going to get busy helping him. Guys, if this is your first time tuning in, thanks. Welcome, by the way. And just real quick, tell you a little bit of what my channel's about. Whether I'm over at my kid's house or, or working around my place, it's just all about knocking out projects one at a time. I always learn something as I go, and I like to share that information with you guys. So if you will, please consider hitting that subscribe, uh, like, and share with your friends. Don't forget to hit that notifier because uh, I usually do uploads a couple of times a week and don't want you guys to miss out on the journey with Project Next One. So anyway, guys, I got a gator to unload. And so you know me, let's get busy. Alright, so right now I'm mixing up what is called total vegetation killer. Uh, a lot of people refer to it as Roundup. I use one of the off brands, or not an off brand, just a different brand. This is uh, from Tractor Supply and it's called Farmworks. Um, pretty much almost an identical formula to Roundup. Uh, it's just a whole lot cheaper to buy. So, anyway, uh, for this, I mix a gallon of, of chemicals to 45 or 44 more gallons. It's a 45 gallon tank uh, and I add 44 gallons of water to it. So I'm in the process now. As you can see, I'm filling up and then here shortly, I will be doing a combination of spreading up my booms and spraying uh, the driveway using the booms and the five nozzles, as well as I will come back and with the product that I have left over, <clears throat> I will be getting the wand out and I will be spraying all up around the house. So anyway, I'll keep filling up and we'll get busy here shortly.
So guys, as you can see, it didn't take very long at all to knock out this project. Um, I've been here less than an hour and I'm already finished up and uh, Gator's back on the trailer. Uh, to me, this comes down to one thing, is if you can, I'm very blessed. Uh, I looked and looked and looked and I finally found uh, this device. Um, it's the only one that I saw uh, in an affordable price range that would work in the back of my Gator that had a 10 foot boom and with the five nozzles, it has a 12 foot wide spray. So it, this thing has just worked flawlessly since I've gotten it. And I'm just so pleased with the way it works. And it just makes spraying weeds uh, so easy. So for me, I use this for total vegetation killer, which is what I put down today. I uh, also use it for putting down liquid fertilizer and I also do pre and post emergence with it. And it has just been fantastic to have. And so far it's worked flawless. Now, if you look back at some of my other videos and I will include uh, this video in the end screens uh, when I first got it I was trying to run it off the uh, cigarette lighter plug-in and I realized that I kind of learned through the hard way of the limitations and I was blowing fuses like crazy so I'll include uh, the video please check that out on finding the true 15 amp power sources on a gator uh, as long as you can feed that with a 15 amp source which is what it requires to, to turn the pump up and put the fluid out uh, you won't have any problems at all so anyway guys that'll do it for me i'm gonna strap down the old gator in the trailer and i'm gonna head back to the homestead but uh, i enjoy coming out helping my son when i can and uh, today was just an afternoon uh, to where i was able to get this done for him and was glad to do it so anyway guys you guys uh, have a great week upcoming. Stay safe. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll check you later.